A principal and a school board both in the hot seat tonight. A Rocky River principal on leave in June after a reported incident involving a former high school student submitted his resignation last month. And tonight, the Rocky River School Board is going to consider it. News 5's Nadine Abusada spoke to the mother of that student about what she said happened and what she thinks should happen. Gigi Latori is still processing what took place at Rocky River High School. He was, you know, he was very concerned with my son. He was very, you know, he was like a father figure to my son. In June, Gigi found text messages between her son and someone that went by the name H-Dog. Just him basically saying when you're coming over to drink and he'll show bottles of liquor. Just like he's talking to a friend, like his age. According to police, the messages started in 2019 and Gigi says they continued until 2023, which is when she learned he was texting Heath Horton, who was the vice principal of Rocky River High, where her child went. He took advantage of a child that he knew needed somebody like him. She then immediately called her sister, whose kids are also in Rocky River schools. I, I did feel betrayed. I felt really bad. I felt bad for my nephew. Um, I felt bad that um, I felt scared too. Like, I'm like, oh my gosh, did something else happen? In 2021, Heath became the principal at Kensington Intermediate School, where in June, he was put on administrative leave as police investigated his relationships with Rocky River High School students. Tonight, the school board is holding a special meeting where according to an agenda, they will be discussing Heath's letter of resignation. For Gigi and Myra, as they and their kids are trying to move on, they want to see a few things. He's gone. He needs to be removed. He needs to not work in the school system anymore. Parents be alert. I just want everyone to be aware and understand that not everything is what it seems. And hope the school system they are a part of will make changes to ensure the safety of their kids. You still have kids in the school system. What is next? <clears throat> I love Rocky River, don't get me wrong. Uh, this is my community. This is my home. We've been here for many, many years. Um, I, I really do just want to see a change. Um, otherwise, who knows, we might have to leave as well. Reporting in Rocky River, Nadina Busada, News 5. So there's been a petition circulating calling for four Rocky River School administrators to step down. The district says they are aware of this and are committed to moving forward in a positive manner. That school board meeting starts at 530 tonight. We are going to bring you complete coverage on News 5 at 11 o'clock.